Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. So these are just going to be a few clips from my trip to Hobby Lobby and then Joanne Fabrics. We traveled to Ohio and I went to the newly renovated Joanne Fabrics back uh, where we're from in Ohio. So there's a few clips of that coming up next. Yes. Nice yarn. Thanks. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Stephanie. And on this channel, we talk about all kinds of crafty things. So anything that I'm working on, making, anything like that. And all my social media is gonna be down below. I am currently it's a sad day. It's a really sad day. <laughs> I'm currently sitting in the parking lot at work. Today is my first day back to work. So my son is a little under eight months old. I was able to stay. It's not like I, I didn't have to go back to work. I think it's just going to be good for me to get out of the house. But... I'm sad. It's weird going back to work and not being with my son all day. To get my mind off of it, I'm going to sit here and crochet and talk to you guys about some stuff. So I was in Ohio with my husband and my son for a few days and we visited family, everyone was able to meet my son finally, all my cousins and whatnot, and then we just got to hang out around Ohio. It was nice. Some of the people I haven't seen since my baby shower in September of 23, so it's been, it's been a minute. So we were in Ohio and I got this sudden urge to want to crochet. So I went and I bought this yarn from Joann's and I took clips because the Joann's uh, back where I'm from in Ohio, they renovated it. So it's one of the nicer ones. And we also did a Hobby Lobby trip before we left. Uh, and that was the first part of the video and then the second part was when we were in Ohio and we went to the new Joann's but this is a blanket that I'm making and so 
and I found this pattern on Pinterest and it's so easy. And this yarn is called Karen Jumbo in the color Baby Rainbow. And then soon here, I'm gonna talk about, I do have to go into work, so I will talk later about all the crafty things that I'm working on, but I just wanted to let you guys know it's my first day back to work and this is what I'm currently working on to keep my hands busy. So let's go get this work day done and then go home and see my baby. <laughs> hey, legit. Grab the hole, grab the hole of the chair and pop down on the bike. My husband just came out here and showed me a video that I just, my, my son pulled himself up onto his two feet. He's not even eight months old and he pulled himself up and was standing. Time needs to slow down. But anyway, the rest of this video is just going to mainly just be a voiceover. Again, I'm sorry if you don't like those kinds of videos, but just since I have been back to work and my son is obviously on the go, so he is just, just awake and crawling around and he has like a walker thing and he walks up and down the hallway and it's just kind of madness in my house at the moment. Don't have a ton of time for videos anymore. I'm, I'm trying to get a lot of these videos done, but uh, they will be probably a little bit less than what they were before. The rest of this video, I am going to share pictures of stuff that I have completed, stuff that I have started, I'm kind of in the middle of, and patterns that I have available on my Etsy page. All right, first we are going to talk about works in progress or whips. They are mostly cross stitch. First one is this Bubba Pen one, and that is something that I designed myself. I currently have Bub almost done. And this is the project I am doing on 28 count even weave. Next is going to be the progress I have on my Alaska cross stitch. And the story behind this is I want to do a cross stitch for every state that we have lived in while my husband's been in the military. This has been a fun stitch for me and it is on 18 count Ada. My last cross stitch whip is a sampler that I made. It's not currently on my Etsy page right now. I wanna finish the stitch before I post it. Um, but this is what it looks like. It's on an Ada fabric called Vintage Taupe. It's 14 count and I am using the thread. It's like variegated. It's 4210 DMC. And the only crochet whip that I have going on right now is this crochet baby blanket. I'm really liking this pattern. It's an easy pattern repeat and it's working up really, really fast. I got the yarn from Joanne Fabrics and it is Karen Jumbo and everything will be linked below about this pattern in the description box. Next is going to be finished items. So first thing is going to be these super cute crochet starfish hot pads. I actually got this pattern from Yarnspirations and I'll tag it down below, but I thought these turned out so cute. I used I Love This Cotton from Hobby Lobby and I think the colors are just perfect. Next is going to be a pattern from Bag O'Day Crochet. I'll tag the YouTube video below, but she had these decorative crochet chickens. So I decided to make one and then I thought they were so cute that I made it into a sticker. How awesome is this sticker? <laughs> I have this sticker available on my Etsy pages if anyone is interested. Next, I have a couple crochet sunflower hot pads that I thought turned out so cute and are perfect decor for summertime. And last, I knitted up this heart-shaped hot pad. It was super easy. I'll tag the pattern down below. It's super easy to follow and it turned out really cute. 
All right, and last, we're going to talk about some cross-stitch patterns that I have available on my Etsy page. I have a few that are just like cute little sayings, like home sweet home, and I want to be a nice person, but people are stupid. I thought that was hilarious. <laughs> and then I have a love wreath one that I finished up recently. And then I have the letters A through Z available on this cute little multicolored background. I have these and more available on my Etsy page that'll be linked below. So if you have any questions, please comment down below. I'll have everything linked in the description of the video and we will see you in the next video. If you like this video, please remember to give it a big thumbs up, do all the YouTube things, consider subscribing to the channel and we will see you in the next one. Bye guys.